Hi everyone and welcome to my channel. So today I have for you a Dollar Tree haul. I went to Dollar Tree and I found some items that I wanted to share with each of you. Um, I went to a one Dollar Tree, I spent $80, I went to another Dollar Tree and I spent $31. Um, I did pick up um, items for three different families, so which is why um, there's you know so much money spent. So um, a lot of this I bought in multiples and I have divided this up into three hauls so we'll do a series um, because there was quite a lot of items and I'm just going to show you the one singles a lot of them I bought like I say in multiples so up here is a mixture of all the things that I bought and I just divided all the things up in the other piles too if that makes sense like this isn't like specifically food and one of the other ones isn't specifically toys it's just a mixture of all the things so let's hop right in I'm going to show you what I got um I went in with the intent of buying essentials like food um that type of thing and then buying items for the kids to keep them entertained where we're having you know a hard time staying at home they are also so I wanted to you know be able to buy them some items that their mothers can um, dole out to them you know each day not to give them all the things at one time but you know systematically give them something new to entertain themselves with so that is what I have done and I will be getting those items to um, to my granddaughter and to my great nephew over the next couple of days as I get these videos um, recorded so we'll jump right in and let me show you what I picked up so I picked up some puzzles I want to say these are for my granddaughter but boredom overtook me and I worked these puzzles these are really good puzzles um, takes me a couple hours to work them. I have some bigger puzzles but I don't think my attention span could put together a puzzle much more than 300. Um, I love puzzles. I've always liked to work puzzles. That was something that me and my mother would do but these with the 300 pieces is perfect um, you know especially if you have ADHD like I do. So really good puzzles. Uh, I will say that the um, the pieces are easily put into the wrong place, if that makes sense. Because they're a little thinner, it's easier to get them into the wrong place. And it throws off the scale of the puzzle. I had a little trouble with that. Um, so, you kind of have to be careful when you're putting it together. Because it, it can't throw the whole puzzle off. Anyway, that probably doesn't make sense. But if you work one of these puzzles, you'll you'll understand what I'm saying. Okay, um, I picked up the kids some, or I picked up these for my granddaughter because they're erasers. Um, so I think she'll like these. You get one of these. So I picked those up for my granddaughter. I picked me up a, a chocolate milk. I've never had the shelf stable chocolate milk so I will probably drink that in the morning um, I love chocolate milk so there's that bought me some more facial wipes these work really good they do cut through the mascara and um, I like that next I picked up my uh, nephew a few of these to play with thought these were um, would be something that he would like. He is five, so I think he can um, play with these with no problem. So those will be good. I will, um, you know, go drop those off on their porch and they'll sit there all day and, you know, whatever. Just so the virus can get off of them if there is one and all the safety, whatever. We'll put them on their porch. His mama will, um, you know, get them for him after a couple of hours has passed and, um, and dole those out to him to keep him busy. So, um, moving on, I picked my daughter up uh, some of these Maybelline. This is the color Violet. I've said it a many times. My daughter loves makeup and all things makeup and hair and nails and all the things. So, she can add these to her makeup supply 
pick those up. I picked up some a pepperoni. I want to make um, some pepperoni crescent rolls. You take a, the the crescent um, sheet, like the dough, and separate it and put a little bit of um, spaghetti sauce on each triangle. Some cheese and a couple pepperonis. Roll them up, pop them in the oven, um, let them you know get get brown and then you could dip that into uh, some marinara or uh, pizza sauce so I want to try that so I picked those up next I picked up some of these um, Crayola magic permanent markers um, they had three different colors so I picked up each one I like that I liked the colors I really like that peachy color. So I picked those up. Next I picked up some Red Heart yarn. I don't know what I'm going to use this for but I saw it and so I went ahead and picked it up. It was the first time I had seen this. I don't, I don't even know if it's already done or if you have to do that. I don't know but that's what I picked up. Next I picked up some of these uh, banana chips I have tried these these are good these I have not tried so I wanted to um, you know pick them up I like to eat these for snacks um, this next week will be my week to work from home one week at home one week at my job vice versa so this week will be my week at home so I want to make sure I had some snacks here at the house and so I picked those up next I picked up some of these these seats they did have these in the Easter section uh, where the candy aisle is these guys are so awesome if you were going to um, you know be in the water floating these are so good you put your noodle in there um, the ones we had we had forever so the elastic that goes on the arm is kind of uh, outstretched out and uh, so I picked up two of these actually I picked up four because I forgot I had already picked some up and I picked up two more so um, these are good they keep you in the water so you know you get a float and you're like on top of the water and like it's awkward but these like let you get under the like you're like in the water floating so, I like those. They're awesome. Uh, I got me a Sudoku uh, book. I love to work like crossword, word search, seek and find, all the things. So, I wanted to pick that up. I picked up some Littlest Pet Shop stickers. One for me and one for my granddaughter. I like to do layouts, character layouts in my planner. So, I picked that up. I picked up some of the Southgate chili. This is a really, really good chili. I actually like this better than I do uh, the name brand, like Wolf brand. This is more like chili that you would make at home. It's like juicier, maybe looser. Where I don't know how to explain it. It's really good, though. I, I like it. Picked up some mango slices. I wanted to give this a try, this almond milk barista blend. I picked up one of these for me and one for my um, for my daughter. Her and her best friend like to make all the different kinds of coffees and all that stuff. So I thought they might like to do that. I picked up some cream of chicken. Picked up some chicken and chili sauce tamales. Picked up my great nephew some pa Sour Patch Kids cereal. I thought he might enjoy that. So I picked that up for him. I picked up a new um, Glade. This is Sultry Spiced R Rhythm. Black rum, leather, and mint. So I haven't tried it. Wait, I don't know. I didn't smell nothing. I don't smell it. Maybe my allergies are so messed up I'm not smelling. I don't really smell it. 
Okay, that's weird. I don't know. Okay, maybe it smells good. I don't know. I can't smell it. Picked up some paper towels. One buck. That's a good buy, I feel like. And then uh, last but not least, for this part one of this haul, is I picked up uh, these. I thought these would be super cute. You know, um, it's almost Easter, obviously. And by the time you see this, Easter may have already be over with. Um, so summertime's coming. I thought this would make a cute banner. I'm sure there are a lot of crafty ladies here on YouTube that are going to do something amazing with this. So I did pick up two and I was excited um, to make some kind of like a banner or something out of that. I, I thought it was really cute. So anyway, guys, that's it. That is my haul. This is the first part of a series of three. Um, I hope you're having an amazing day. I have. I worked, like I say, I worked my puzzle. I cooked this morning. Of course, this is the outfit that I, I was in when I filmed the... Um, egg hack the egg sandwich hack video um so i just don't know what day you're gonna see this video but anyway i hope y'all are doing amazing i hope everyone is healthy and safe and your family is doing great if you've liked this video please give it a thumbs up hit the subscribe button become part of my friends here on youtube and y'all take care bye